Want to get cheat sheets, audiobooks, lessons, apps, and much more every month for free? Just click the link in the description to get your free language gifts of the month. Hi everyone, welcome back to Korean Top Words. In this lesson, we'll be talking about top 10 phrases to know when having a baby. Let's begin. 모유 수유를 하다, to breastfeed. 모유 수유를 하다, to breastfeed. I heard that more and more mothers are um, doing the breastfeeding these days because it's um, good for their kids. In a sentence, you can say, 엄마가 모유 수유를 하고 있어요. The mother is breastfeeding. 기저귀를 갈다, to change a diaper. 기저귀를 갈다, to change a diaper. In a sentence, you can say, 기저귀를 하루에 여러 번 갈아요. Which means, I change diapers many times a day. 턱받이를 채우다, to put on a bib. 턱받이를 채우다, to put on a bib. In a sentence, you can say, 우리 아이에게 턱받이를 채우는 게 힘들어요. Which means, it is hard to put on a bib on our baby. 옷을 갈아입히다, to change clothes. 옷을 갈아입히다, to change clothes. So, 옷을 갈아입히다 is a passive expression, so it means you make someone change the person's cloth. In a sentence, you can say, 우리 아이는 옷을 갈아입히려고 하면 도망가요. My child runs away when we try to change the clothes. 자장가를 부르다, to sing a lullaby. 자장가를 부르다, to sing a lullaby. 자장가 has the word 가, which means a song. 자장, I think it has a connection with the verb 자다, which means to sleep. In a sentence, you can say, 자장가를 부르면 졸려요. I get sleepy when I sing a lullaby. 낮잠을 자다, to take a nap. 낮잠을 자다, to take a nap. One of my friends who just gave a birth said that, um, like when her baby is awake, like she really want her baby to take a nap, 낮잠을 자다. But when the baby takes a nap, then she really wants her to be awake because um, the baby is doing something cute, like when she's when he's awake. So she said it's kind of dilemma. Like um, in a sentence, you can say, 아기와 낮잠을 잘때 행복해요. I feel happy when I take a nap with my baby. 먹이다 to feed. 먹이다 to feed. I think you know the verb 먹다, meaning to eat, and 먹이다 is the passive form of the verb 먹다. So it means something like to make someone eat. So it means to feed. In a sentence, you can say, 이유식을 먹여요, which means I feed them baby food. 유모차를 밀다, to push a stroller. 유모차를 밀다, to push a stroller. Now, these days, we just say babysitter when we want to say something about babysitter. But in the past, people used the word 유모 when they want to call someone who is taking care of a baby. Um, so 유모차 means something like babysitting car, literally. In a sentence, you can say 유모차를 밀어줄래요? Could you push the stroller? 목욕을 시키다, to bath. 목욕을 시키다, to bath. So when you take a bath for yourself, you can say 목욕을 하다. But when you make someone else to take a bath, you can say 목욕을 시키다. In a sentence, you can say 하루에 한번 아기 목욕을 시켜요. I bath the baby once a day. 이유식을 만들다, to make baby food. 이유식을 만들다, to make baby food. One of the popular baby food in Korea is bunyu, which means powdered milk. But these days, more and more people make their baby food by themselves for, you know, giving better, like, food for their baby. So in a sentence, you can say 채소로 이유식을 만들어요. Which means that I make baby food with vegetables. That's all top 10 phrases to know when having a baby. I hope you like some of the words that we introduced in this video. Make sure to subscribe and we'll see you in the next video. 다음 시간에 뵙겠습니다. 안녕히 계세요.